Oh, thank you. Oh, thank you, young man. It's a long drive. Sleep now while you can. There's no way I can sleep now. Nazis and the Japanese army are an alliance, and I wouldn't be surprised if Shinkai's division in particular were engaged in some kind of joint operation. If they're both that hungry for victory... It would appear that their available resources are getting stretched pretty thin since the war effort in Russia got bogged down last year. What do you think, Bill? It really pisses me off that we've been given a Pandora's box by the devil himself and sit here trying to stare down Medusa. And what I just can't accept is that they actually went so far as to use a child to steal a module. But why is it that they didn't finish off the Fugaku? It, it sure looked to me as if they had enough firepower to do it. If they couldn't, then it's reasonable to assume there must be a reason. Perhaps there was a problem with the operator. Do you think it would be any different from us operating the Kishin, Eva? I'm not sure of that. There may very well be some problems with the Nazi Kishin that they may not have solved yet. But what really scares me is that the Fuhrer is putting so much faith in the power of the gods. The gods? What on earth are you talking about? Astrology and prophecy, you mean? It's a feasible scenario that the Fuhrer, who has a strong faith in the occult, might somehow link up with the aliens. I wish I was just making this up. There's only one thing that could match that level of energy. What Albert proposed to President Roosevelt is a new type of bomb with an anti-alien purpose. Its code name is Glamour Girl, but there is a downside to it. What's the downside? It could make Albert an enemy of humanity. Enemy of humanity? You mean if it gets out of control? I kept my part of the bargain. Now you keep yours. Albert has always urged our Kishin Corps to cherish peace. He's telling us to realize the importance of what we'll lose in return for the power of science. Do you think maybe there's something in Maria's letter? Well, right now she's on her way to my lab in Lucian. I don't know what she can do for us, but um, I'm more concerned about getting the module back. Don't worry. We've sent Barejo and Taishi after it. I hope Taishi's going to be okay. Well, he's with Bareho. No, he was obsessed with that kid who attacked Eva. Ah, just as I thought. One of our people in Germany spotted a youth carrying the module box. Well then, let's prepare ourselves to be able to link up with Bareho at a moment's notice. If it starts to resonate, we're gonna be in trouble. Yes, please, get on it. Well, all right then, Bill. We'll all be standing by, ready to join up with Taishi when we're needed. Right, Daisuk? You bet! Huh? All right! Nice teamwork! <laughs> Victory! 
should leave soon to avoid suspicion. Yes, you're right. I vow to see to it that our homeland is returned and rebuilt. Hey you, what are you doing here? Let's see inside. I assure you there's no one- Open up! But, but- uh... It's okay, open up. Huh? Out of the way! Uh, oh. Is this any way to treat Lieutenant Fujishima of the Shinkai Division? Well, no ma'am. I'm extremely sorry. Is there somebody here? Oh, Eva Braun. Huh? You grew your hair, I see. I didn't recognize you. When did you return to Lucian? Huh? Um, last week. The main thing is that you're safe. When you were taken by the Kanto army, I thought it was going to be the end for you. Huh? It's nice that your dream of living together with your sister wasn't destroyed. Eva. One thing I'd better tell you, it's fine to go ahead and get involved in some research, but you'd better steer clear of the Luvan Library. That area is under Goebel's control. Oh, I see. I believe that we will meet again, Eva Braun. The Luvan Library. Jack, welcome home. Welcome to what? Looks like they've multiplied again. You think so? They have. There's no doubt about it. Well, what's wrong with that? Yeah, don't go spoiling my fun there, Jack. <laughs> Captain? They're all my friends, Jack. Right? Hey, Captain, I brought We're you all the ball. Good kids. <laughs> let's play now. Come on, let's uh -huh. play, okay? Here you go. Look, Jack, let Captain enjoy himself, okay? Well, okay. Hey, Jack! Catch! Huh? Ah! Now you've done it! Ah! This particular piece of metal armor is the pilot suit for the operator of our Kishin. A mass production like this means your division is that big? That is correct. Our Nazi advance is not to be carried out by halves. We can't afford to be behind in quantity and quality. These are our candidates to pilot the module body. They've been chosen from among the elite of each division. They were selected in particular for their loyalty as Nazis. Loyalty? To operate the module requires a combination of both mental and physical power. Something that would be out of the question for the average man. I don't want to know about your personal ambitions, Colonel, but I assume that the Japanese army suffered quite a setback after withdrawing from Guadalcanal Island. I wonder what will happen in Manchuria. As a matter of fact, with the death of General Yamamoto, the future of Manchuria is uncertain. But the puppet government is satisfied with the Kanto army. <laughs> I'll soon make it clear just where the real puppet government lies. <sighs> hey, hey, Barejo. Jeez, you should have woken me up. There was nothing for me to wake you up for. 
Besides, it was kind of a nice treat for me to have you behave yourself for a while. Hmm. Hey, is that the place where those Nazi kitchen bastards are supposed to be? <laughs> where? Where? Captain. That's Captain, isn't it? Apparently, they just barely made it here from Eurogena Bank. You knew about that? Yeah. What the hell? Couldn't you have told me? I'll be back in a minute. Wait a second. We didn't come here to play, you know. Borejo, how can you even say that when you know I've been separated from them since that time? And before I even knew it, I got sucked into the kitchen core. Maybe it's better if you don't see them. It's better than regretting not seeing them. Taishi! I came to help you out. Babysitting that kid never gets any easier. <clears throat> well, he's like a little brother to me. You got a lot of nerve coming here, Tai Chi. Jack! City, May 7th, 1940. You expect me to swallow all that bullshit about Maria having a twin sister and all? But I tell you, it's true. You just gotta believe me, Jack. No way, man. All I know is if you hadn't shown up, none of this crazy shit would have happened. What about Pearl and Cookie? Are they doing okay? Pearl's the same as ever. But Cookie, and Faye, and Mac... Ugh. The war's being fought by adults. And we're the ones who get caught in the middle. You're not like us anymore. You're one of them. You're wrong. Our enemies aren't the Americans or the British. It's the aliens. And your Kishin Corps is in conspiracy with them, isn't it? It's not. Who told you that? It doesn't matter who. Oh, well, it's time for business. Business? That's right. Someone's gonna give me good money for that thing. And here he is. The Kanto Army? No way, Jack! You're not giving the module to them! That Japanese keeps his promises. He's not like you at all. The Kanto army has arrived. Shall I join you, Daisak? Don't worry, Taishi and I can handle it. Well now, Taishi, don't ever think of coming round here again, or I swear you'll live to regret it. Hold on there, Jack! <laughs> you son of a bitch! <laughs> Remember me? Huh? Uh, uh, hey, uh, hey! Uh, you think you can get that away from me? Uh, you little rat! Uh, get away from uh, me! Hey! Uh, stop it! Uh, Isn't that sad, a big guy like that picking on a kid, huh? Uh, 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 oh! Uh, that's enough! Uh, 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 Tishy! Oh, oh. Give it to me! No way! 
Give it to me! Forget it! Stop, stop screwing around and give him a taste of your specialty! Shut your face! I'm gonna take care of this my own way! Jack! Uh, you little... Huh? Taishi! Taishi! Hey, Jack. Look, I'm sorry for all the trouble. <sighs> all is not forgiven. Hurry up and let go! Yeah, I think I will. Huh? It's too bad, though. Uh, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, uh, <gasps> uh, that hurt! Uh. That would be the resonance effect. Colonel, I would now like to give you a thorough demonstration of the finished Nazi Kishin. Yes, a thorough demonstration to be sure. Burejo, it's up to you! Taishi! Huh? Taishi. Uh, Daisak? Sorry, but I dropped the module. What? What did you say? Could it have dropped into the hands of the Kanto army? What'd you say? You don't know that. What's going on there, Jack? Howdy, Captain. Hey, you uh, want to come give me a hand? T Taishi! Taishi! It's just like before. It means the aliens are coming. We've got to get out of here right now. Daisak! I'll be fine. Get, get out of here! What do you mean you'll be fine? <laughs> that scared me. Okay, everybody, let's do what our friend here says and get away from here. Okay, this way. Huh? Dorothy! Huh? Jack, you look after these guys.
Core will come out on top. Is everybody here? Okay, it's okay. Don't worry. Look at that. The aliens appeared as soon as you came strolling along. Don't be a moron. The aliens are connected to the Nazis. The Japanese module body is no match against the power of my pants and knight. No doubt. No doubt indeed. The Nazi kitchen is impressive, and I want it. I'm going to wipe that smirk off your face. Taishi? Huh? That one was your friend, wasn't it? Go on, Taishi. I'm not gonna leave you guys, okay? Ah, stop making like a hero. I'm not making like nothing, Jack. Take this. All you gotta do is bring it back. You promise? Jack. I promise. What you see now, Colonel, is the resonance effect. If one can tune in to their wavelength, they won't attack. What in the world is that? Jack? Taishi, come back someday. Don't worry, he'll be back. That guy needs one good smack in the head for sure. Can I give you guys a hand? Huh? 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 How about it? This is...
Please come with us, Doctor. I mean, Maria Braun. Thank <laughs> you. 